So this BBC presenter who is involved in this scandal is reacting via The Sun, which is reporting this. Hey guys, that's Marat Brownlee. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. Back at again with another video. If you have not subscribed, I would really appreciate it. Click that button and subscribe. It is 3 a.m. in the morning. Do subscribe for daily and consistent content. Inject it. Click that button. It is 24-7 content, 365 days of the year. Fresh, fresh, fresh. Anyways, let's get into this video, guys. Somebody said, why do you keep saying daily and consistent? That is my slogan. I say this on the channel. I say it every day. Been saying it for the last four years. I'm not going to change. Anyways, the presenter at hand, who this is, is reacting and he is absolutely panicking, the sun is saying. Um, panicked top BBC presenter who paid for those intimate pictures has now called the youngster two times. Um, the presenter who was suspended today allegedly rang last week asking, what have you done? What have you done? It is claimed he also asked the youngster to ring their mum to get her to stop the investigation. The government demanded answers from BBC Chief Tim Davey as the Met Police were contacted as part of the investigation and the Met Police will be meeting the BBC Corporation later on today to have this conversation. So the fact that he obviously is now panicking and you know he's really shocked by what is going on and realising that his career is effectively going to end when he becomes public, I think that let's just say, I'm not going to say names at this moment of time, but let's just say that presenter names are narrowing down. And there's, you know, one that is being in conversation more than others, who is Welsh. And it looks like it could be him, which could be a shock for a lot of people because, you know, he did cover the coronation, the Queen's passing. We've seen him on BBC 24-7. Even if you don't know him as a child growing up, you would just always see him. Even now you would see him, a household name in the BBC world. So, you know, these reports that he's panicking, forcing and pressurizing the youngster to retract everything. And notice how this is the first reaction from a much older man going to a young 20-year-old girl or boy. I did say boy initially because I think the gender did slip. I think it is a boy um, um, as far as I'm concerned. I don't, I don't think it is a girl because a lot of people now are also saying it's a boy. But even if it's a boy or girl, regardless, it's an important matter. But notice how the first chess move for these grown men who take advantage of these young teenagers and lure money around them, believe me, I know about it, Notice how their first moment or movement, sorry, is to go to that youngster. Normally you would think that's the dumbest thing you would do. Why would you go back to the scene of the crime, as they say? He's returning to that person to try and control them and to say, listen, I have more money. Retract everything. Abuse of power, just like we saw with Schofield, he's doing the same thing. He's trying to see if he can garnish power and use it upon the youngster yet again to say retract everything try and threaten him or here's more money or luring or go to the mother and trying to just make sure everything disappears because that is the first thing that he does that most men do when it comes to young boys or girls to try and control them they go directly to the source to try and control them normally you wouldn't go to the scene of the crime you would go to lawyers you would go to xyz you would go to this this that but that's what a lot of these people do and it's a very interesting manipulative chess move that we see with a lot of older men when it comes to them interacting with young children or you know late teens I don't care what you say 16 17 18 19 20 year old being in contact with 40 50 year old men there is still manipulative abuse of power going on so it's very scary guys subscribe to the channel click that button I wanted to give you guys this quick four minute update it is 3 a.m. in the morning this news came out and I decided to film this now. It will be coming out later on today. So I put so much effort in these quick videos for you guys. So I would really appreciate it if you guys do click that button and subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate it. Subscribe, click that button, comment down below, sound off in the comments. Follow me on my Instagram at Murad underscore Morali. It is in the bio below and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.